guys welcome to this video so i completely forgot to record an intro before and after this workout so this is your intro but we are going 30 minutes 30 minutes only with rest and the workout for a lower body more specific glute gym based workout so here we are starting off kind of warming up our lower body and our glutes with three sets of 15 kettlebell squats i am holding a 25 pound kettlebell help here which is not crazy difficult for me, but not easy. I'd say it's medium weight for me. But what I did here is really focus on putting all my weight in my heels, driving up through my heels, and then really squeezing my glutes at the top of the movement. I want to make sure that I'm pushing my knees out. And again, that glute squeeze at the top is the most important thing right here. That is what's going to activate your glute and then get them ready for our next exercise because our next exercise is going to be a more glute specific work or exercise. And you just want to make sure it's all warmed up so you're getting the most out of that exercise. So again, all your weight in your heels and you got three sets of 15 for a kettlebell squat. The goal with this workout is to take as little of a rest in between. That's why we may be doing higher reps, less weight, um, or things that are you know not crazy difficult because it is supposed to be a workout that really maximizes our glutes and our glute work today, but something that doesn't need a lot of rest and break in between, which is why we're able to keep it at a 30 minute mark. Next, we are jumping into a sumo squat sumo stance deadlift i freaking love these and rave about these 24 7 if i can for your glutes this is your bff and it's crazy because this first set right here i chose a i think it was 45 pound dumbbells which is like i remember doing what was the last time i was in the gym maybe three months ago four months ago and this weight being so hard not hard but it was difficult and this was nothing. I had to bump it up to 50 in the gym I was at today only had up to 50. If they had more, I probably would have done 55 or even 60 to challenge myself. But I went ahead and did three sets of 12 reps here. And my point of telling you that is that all my workouts that I've been posting, all those at home, lower body, full body workouts have made me so much stronger that when I get to my weighted workouts, it's my last time I did these exercises with these weights, they're too easy. So try, try, try to do a month or two of my workouts that you guys have been doing. And I promise you, you're going to get stronger and you're going to lean out. But enough about that. Three sets of 12 reps right here for a sumo stance deadlift. So your goal is to come up slowly with all that weight in your heels and get a huge glute squeeze at the top because that is the very, very most important thing in this whole entire exercise. Next we got some walking lunges. I went ahead and did an overhead plate hold thingy. I just held a plate over my head and I did 12 reps on each side. So I did only 10 pound weights. If I was trying to go a heavy leg day and really, really, really push myself and be in the gym, maybe a little bit longer than 30 minutes, I would have for sure held a 25 pound plate for me over my head. This weight was not bad. Um, by my third set, I was definitely feeling it, but to challenge myself, I would have done 25, but to get in and out of the gym and still feeling it after my last two exercises, sticking here with the 10 pound or 10 pound plate was perfect for me. So three sets of 12 reps right here. And then we're rolling into a little bit heavier of a movement. This Smith machine had a lot of resistance, so I feel like I really didn't have to push back as much and really try as much, so to speak, to feel that lift or that pull in my hamstrings. But I went ahead and did three sets of 12 reps of these with a 25 on each side. Again, that's a moderate weight for me. I could have done three or four sets of 15 and really felt it, but I really wanted to focus on pushing my butt back, getting that glute squeeze at the top and really feeling that stretch in my hamstring. So this weight was pretty moderate for me, but I did three sets of 12 reps with about 15 to 20 seconds of rest in between. So after that, my hamstrings are feeling it and I'm really looking forward to being sore tomorrow because I know it's gonna happen. And here we're wrapping up to our last two exercises. Bulgarian split squats I freaking hate I love them because they're so good and your butt cheeks feel them and your quad feels it but I hate them like I kept getting a cramp in my butt cheek and my quad and I was just I thought I was dying so we're gonna go ahead and do three sets of 15 reps for this right here you got 15 reps on one side and 15 reps on the other um you just gotta get that stretch and you gotta push yourself and get as low as you can I go as low I go so low that I feel like I'm not gonna get back up but I know I'm gonna get back up 
So if you know what I mean by that, then do that. But look at that, like, ooh, glutes, they look good in that position. So you got three sets of 15 reps of these right here. Feel the burn. I definitely took the most rest through this exercise, the most. And coming into our last thing, we're going to superset. And this is probably my second most rested exercise, not so much for the stamina part, but for the burn. I'm gonna go ahead and do three sets for this superset. Our first exercise is going to be 15 hamstring curls, keeping everything in my heels and really, really not allowing that butt to come down because that is the most important. And then you're just gonna keep your feet flat on the ball as you'll see here in a second. Now go ahead and do 15 glute bridges. Um, if your butt doesn't tap the floor, I don't on every rep just because it's such a farther way down um, and I don't need to, sometimes I just do but you got 15 reps of these. So I hope you guys enjoyed this workout. It should only take you 30 minutes. If it takes you longer, you're taking too much of a rest, but I hope you guys enjoyed this workout and I will talk to you all in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe. And I never know what I was missing if they didn't. Cause I'd have never 